this is gonna be a relatively simple video. It's so some people have noticed that the new vector firmware from Digital Dream Labs has new animations such as loose pixel, tangram, and binaryize. So they're wondering how to get that to work with WirePod. Now, obviously those firmwares, they don't have a WirePod version. So what I did was I created a custom upload OTA site with ver with a lot of versions. You can see here, these are all modified to work with WirePod. So I'm gonna show you how to get them installed. It's pretty simple. So first put vector into recovery mode. As you can see, mine is in recovery mode. Don't mind, don't mind the weirdness, but you can see there the version is 0 0.9. This is just a custom recovery I'm working on. So you want to obviously double click to get the key screen. Once you get the key screen and go over here and pair with vector, uh, as you can see my ID is over there, and hit pair. Now get your code. In my case, mine is 100, nine, I mean 598. Now it's gonna to update to whatever version you have selected at the top. In my case, I have 2.0.1.6085 EP selected. That is the newest firmware version for Vector at the moment. So you just wanna let this update. It's gonna take some time. Just like go get a cup of coffee, coffee or something. Once it's done, what you do is you just reauthor WirePod the normal way. You go to WP Setup, that WP Setup site in the bot setup, and you just connect with Vector using that site. And uh, yeah, it's pretty simple. The website you need is modern.my.2 slash EP. All right, go to the site, you'll get this, select the firmware you want, and this will always, I'll keep this up today as much as I can. But for now, the latest is 2.0.1.6085 EP. And I'll keep the, this updated with the latest version always selected at the top. All right, that should be simple enough. All right.